yes, it has sunk in now because I have a match to shoot tomorrow. Uh, but the feeling is surreal. I feel so good. I feel really happy that I could win this medal for all of us. And this is coming home. Um, after so long, so many years, it's been for uh, for shooting uh, in the uh, like winning a medal, podium finish and all. So I'm so happy that it's coming home with me, and maybe many more will come in the following days. Um, maybe in shooting or other sports, but many more. Many more can actually happen if Manu can get just two more. <laughs> it's all right. It can be a better color as well. Yeah, I can try. I will definitely try my best. But you never know, like what the outcome shall be. So, but you know what? What this medal has done actually mm -hmm. on the very second day of the Olympics, India has won a medal. So the start you have given the India the right kick start and the boost to all the other athletes across sports, including shooting, mm -hmm. to. To pack a punch and you know go yeah I realize that it it probably g uh, gives confidence even if I have heard about somebody like winning a medal on day one I would be um, energized too I would be also confident okay I need to like you know push myself I need to try my best give my best efforts so I'm grateful that I could do it for anyone who feels that way but so and you also know the history, right? You are the first Indian women shooter. Yes, by now many Olympic people have told medal. me. So, so that is also history you have created. So a lot of history you have created. How does it uh, being part of so many history and and what it has done is that a lot of medal people were saying shooting medals not coming somewhere or the other. You have kicked the door. You have opened the floodgates. Now I think medal starts <laughs> flowing. Um. Well, I'm hoping that, and we definitely look at the positive side. So um, it's not like like we um, shooting cannot give medals and all. It's just you have to put in faith. Okay, one time uh, it was not good or twice it was not good. But you always have to be positive. That's the least you can do. And then you, you can just leave everything on God. Just have faith in God. Talking about the last few moments when you were shooting there at the, when you, at, at the, at the center, you were shooting and... And what was going through your mind when the last few shots, when you knew that you're very close? Oh, I did not know. <laughs> I was not looking at the monitor throughout. So um, I was only shooting. I was only doing my karma and whatever followed, I, I was ready to accept it. Uh, whether it was a gold, whether it was a bronze, whether it was like elimination, whatever it was. Uh, by the time I've, have, I've had so many experiences that I am ready actually. I was ready to take whatever it had in for me. We got to know that you spoke to the PM. Mm -hmm. Did that conversation happen? What, 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 what yeah. was the <laughs> I mean, before coming to the Olympic Games also, we had this session with him, uh, very motivational and all. I'm, uh, I felt really good at that, that he took out time uh, in his, like this busy schedule also, he made time for us. And even after the uh, medal, we had a long conversation and uh, he congratulated me and it me means a lot to me like him taking out time in his like so many things he has to do but yeah and feels uh, good did you did you uh guru dakshina you have already given to the coach with this medal <laughs> this um medal. no i think um we we have set in like with a deal that we will you know start this ngo uh, for sports and all, so for girls and for sports in India. So I think probably I'll start with the NGO. So with everything that I get or with whatever I have. So I'll probably like give a lot of percent in that.